Look how my mind plays. Little bit of fame, little bit of hate, little bit of change. Watch the craze, keep it sane, don't fade away. What is going on, guys? It is Fady, and so I got some news for you about some advanced warfare. Before I get into anything, I just want to say I got a new camera. It's really nice. I'm going to be using it for streaming, uh, video logs, if I ever need to inform you guys about something like I do now. And so, yeah. Well, anyways, let's get back on topic. Uh, recently, Sledgehammer Games has just released a statement, something above the lines of saying, like, uh, you can turn off exoskeletons. And in public matches, there will be certain modes that don't have exoskeletons. And if you guys don't know what I mean by exoskeletons yet, those are the things that makes you that th that's the thing that makes you do all the special abilities like like glide to the left. Uh, let me think. You can hover, uh, cloak, all those things. So basically, just turns them off, like turns all all the exo uh, skeletons off. And so just be certain modes in public matches. So then you can play Call of Duty as Call of Duty Advanced Warfare more as an old styled COD, like a more formal COD and not like crazy having people jumping everywhere, gliding and all that. And I think for competitive, they're gonna they're gonna use that too. So I think in private match there's gonna be certain modes like S and D domination. Uh they're bringing back hard points. So I think it's gonna be S and D domination, hard point capture the flag and all those modes and stuff that have exoskeletons off and i think those would be the rules rules of mlg and i i'll i'll, I'll like that because i don't want to see people jumping around and all that i want want it more to be about strategy and not just jumping around a map and stuff and what else i had to talk about was um all right guys so i'm back sorry i just lost my train of thought for a second and so what i was going to say is uh also, with I think MLG is going to be doing that, so it's going to be hardpoint capture the flag and all those modes that we already know of MLG, and they're going to make it exoskeletons off. So they're going to be, MLG is going to be wanting it to be more of a an old school type of COD, and if they don't do that, they're going to keep exoskeletons on like on. It's just certain abilities will be off. Like I guaranteed cloak will be one. Um, they'll want, they'll just keep the simple ones like glide to the left, glide to the right. All the basic ones that don't really harm the game too much. And so that's what I think they're going to do if they don't take exoskeletons off and all for MLG. Anyways guys, just wanted to inform you guys a little bit more about Advanced Warfare as we're getting closer and closer. I believe it's, a, I, it's about t 2 months and 10 days. I have an app on my phone. It might be 11 days now. But anyway, so yeah. Uh, Destiny Beta, no not Beta, Destiny comes out in about 16 days, I'll be playing that a bunch until Advanced Warfare comes out, so you can expect, expect some gameplay of that. Anyways guys, thanks for watching, rate, comment, make sure to subscribe.